everyone! So today I'm going to be doing a kind of requested video, not like crazy or anything, um, but it's been requested several times so I decided to do it. And first disclaimer, excuse my hair and my outfit, I'm both ready to go dance in like half an hour and I just had to put my hair up and it's still kind of wet and I tried to straighten it but it was wet and I was trying to straighten it and it just didn't work. So, sorry if I look like poop. And this lighting is washing me up, so I still look really, really pale, even though I am getting tanner. But anyway, so this is going to be on basically video editors and what video editor I use. So I'm gonna try to make it like a five-minute video because I just, I just don't think that you need like a ten-minute video on video editors. So basically, um, I have an HP laptop, and I decided once I decided to start making YouTube videos, I used Windows Live Movie Maker. It was already like installed on my laptop. Um, very basic, just like cutting clips out. You can add music. You can put little transitions. Um, it's something that's really great for school projects. I mean, well, I like to go above and beyond on school. Well, my school project wasn't that cool because I was still using Windows Live, but whatever. Um, Something that's great for school projects, um, just really easy, most schools have it, and yeah, so I liked that for a while, but then my video started getting really glitchy, the screen would just like jumble around, like my eyes would be over here, my face would be over here, and it was just glitchy, so um, unfortunately I had to stop using that, even though it was so easy to use and really easy to upload, um, so I do suggest that if it doesn't get glitchy. Um, a really, really great starter for anybody, um, and I think you have to buy it, like, in, like, a Microsoft Office pack. I'm not really sure. But, um, then I decided to go out and get a movie editor, and the first thing that I got was the Sony Vegas Movie Studio HD editor. And the editor actually looked like that. Or it looks like that. And basically, I went to Best Buy, told them I do YouTube videos, and asked for a video editor because Windows Live, Windows Live just wasn't enough for me. I'm like, I need something really basic, really easy to upload, and then they were like, oh, this one should work great. So, of course, I took their advice, and I bought it. It was about $50, and I went home, downloaded it, and it was um, very difficult for me to figure out how to split clips and how to change, like, auto, auto, audio had to change the sound and it just it wasn't working out for me and if you guys know anything about video editors you know you have to like upload your video to your laptop upload it to your editor and then like once you're done editing it you have to save it before it can go on YouTube um, so when you save it it's called rendering in this one um, and it is so difficult to render because like if there are so many options it's like AVI, JPG all these weird options and it says you can upload directly to YouTube but mine would not let me um, so basically it was very very difficult to use and I would like look up YouTube videos on it and these people would be like oh and go in in this setting and change that setting and then change the AVI to JPG for pictures and blah 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 and I'm like what what I want MWV setting I don't get it so this unless you're very advanced I would not suggest I do not like the way it looks it's like gray and looks very old-fashioned and it's very difficult to use. So if I was someone like you guys watching this video, um, and you don't want some, if you want something easy, um, don't get this. But if you're more into like computer electronical stuff, maybe that would be good for you. But then I went back to Best Buy, and I kind of complained to the manager, and I was like, hey, um, I got this one. I can't return it because you can't return software because software basically you could download it and then return it. And be like, haha, I just got free software, basically stealing. Um, and so she said, okay, um, you can't return it, but I will write something on your seat saying that you can exchange it for another one. So I did not exchange it because I love it. I got the Movie Edit Pro Mix by Magic. Sorry, this video is going to be longer than I thought. Um, and it looks like that in the editing process. Basically, I'm going to try to be really short and sweet with this. This is amazing, okay? If you are someone who is really, really basic, get this because you will figure it out so easily and if you're someone who is a little bit more advanced um, I would still suggest this because it has advanced options but it's very easy for people who aren't that smart with it I really like the way it looks like it's like black and sleek it kind of looks like iMovie and um, it comes with this whole manual and it's all in English which 
that sounded stupid but like this isn't like English and then this is French and this is German and this is Spanish you know what I mean it's all English so like this whole thing is about um, the video editor so if you have any questions they will definitely be answered in there compared to the other one where it only had like a downloading little thing like it only told you how to download it but it didn't tell you how to use it um, I find this oh and that one the Sony Vegas I like contacted their hotline and stuff and nobody ever answered nobody ever emailed me back so I'm very disappointed with their customer service but anyway I like this one a lot because it's very very easy to edit with um, it's super easy to cut and split and figure things out and all your questions will be answered in here. You can easily change the tone of your skin or slow down or speed up and talk really fast like a chipmunk if you know what I mean. Maybe I'll do it right now. Um, but yeah, I really, really enjoy this editor. It's very easy to use, but it also has like um, in, in t extensive auto dubbing, add background music, sound effects, high quality sound restoration. Basically, like there's a lot of auto tune you can do with this. I think at least don't take my word on it though. Um, but yeah, there are a lot of advanced options, but there are also a lot of like simple options. So it's something I feel like I'm going to be able to grow with and start off slow but slowly discover um, new options and new things that I can do with it. So I'm very, very excited that I have found this. Um, this is also $50. Um, so I think it's something that's pretty affordable for someone if you're starting to get a little bit more into YouTube. You want cooler videos, better editing, um, stuff like that. I would definitely suggest this because um, uh, it's not like $200 like some of the other editing systems. It's $50. I'm sure you can save up some money. Um, go babysit, mow someone's lawn, I have no idea, but it's $50 for a video editor that I'm going to be using for like years, um, I think is a really good um, price. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you have any more questions about this, just um, message me or comment down below, and I will be having the Urban Decay and Naked 2 giveaway very soon once I hit 7,000 subscribers, so keep subscribing people, and... Look at my little owl now. Isn't he cute? Yeah, so I'm gonna go now because it's like 100 degrees in my room because it's like 110 degrees outside. But anyway, yeah, I'm going to go, but I'll talk to you guys later. Bye, guys.